I'm Sabrina Antoinette, and you're watching Front Row Live. How are you tonight? I'm amazing. How are you? Doing great. I, I'm telling everybody, this event is even crazier. Like it? I do. I like it. What is it? It's, it's, it's Tom's. Tom's. Yeah. It's so I cute. love Tom's. I was like, is that? I like yeah, it. You're right. <laughs> I was on it. Got it. So what do you think about the event? It's crazy today. I think it's crazy, but it's crazy awesome because anytime we can go and help kids, it's who doesn't like that, you know? Exactly. So. Exactly. And you have a couple releases on your own right now. I do. I do. My uh, single just came out and my video just came out on MTV Buzzworthy. So we're really excited about it. Yeah. Cool. And, uh, tell us about the single. Uh, it's called I Know You're Out There. And it's basically for all those people that just really like... They've hit rock bottom. They don't feel like love is there. Like, it's there. Don't worry. Just you can't give away. up. You really can't give up. You can't go into that place and you're just like, oh, God. Now, what inspired that? Did, did all the people thinking that inspired it or did you have that, that yeah. chance sometimes? Pretty much. Just I just feel like everybody feels that way, you know? And I had a bunch of friends that are, like, depressed and everything. And it's just like, it's going to happen when it's supposed to happen. So I put that message out there. Seriously. And, and you, you're signed by Chris Brown, right? I am. How did that opportunity happen? You know what? It's really funny. I was at a club one night in Texas. I'm from Texas. Okay. And um, I was walking to my section in the VIP, and this guy like literally touched my arm, and he said, excuse me, who are you? And I was like, I'm Sabrina. And he goes, well, what do you do? And I was like, well, I sing and write songs. And he's like, don't leave here without giving me your information. And I was like, OK, whatever. And I walked off. But then I had to go like leave later, and he touched me. He's like, hey, I was really, really serious. And uh, we exchange information. Next day, he texts me his email, and we've been working for about three years together now. So he never saw you perform. He just liked you the no. way you look. No, I and thank God, like I sent him some songs. Looking back, like they're the worst songs ever. But he heard something and he liked it. So I'm very fortunate. I'm very blessed to be working with someone like that. So now with, with the the new releases and and everything going on, do you have any tour plans coming up? Oh, definitely, definitely. Right. I mean, should I just like tell? Should I text you and you should let me you know? know? Yeah. Okay, let me know. I'm at the Roxy this Friday, and I have a residency at the House of Blues every last Friday of the month. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Well, definitely hope to check you out. Definitely.